Welcome to the Minecraft Legacy Edition. So picture yourself, it's 2012 or 2013, depending on what year it is that you started playing this game. And you sit down and relax, came back from school, and you, you fire up Minecraft, and the new update came out, and they added a new dimension, and it's the end. They added a new boss in the game called the Ender Dragon. You know, you got no homework, it's the weekend, it's just, it's great. All you're doing is sitting in your room, trying to get to the end, trying to find the new stronghold that they added, and trying to beat the Ender Dragon. We're going to be playing the Legacy Edition of Minecraft, and I believe it's TU12. I don't know what year this update came out, but I had to say 2012, 2013, even though 2012 is when this came out, when TU1. So this is uh, about TU12, so I'd say 2013, maybe 14. And here we go, we spawn into a, a nice swamp here. Oh yes, look at that, we got some bread, some sticks, stuff, it's, it's basically the same. Let's go ahead and just take it for old time's sake. Look at this, look at this bare world, like there's not, there's nothing to it. This is great. This actually, I love, oh man, I miss Minecraft when it was like this. We have pigs and stuff. I miss playing on the Xbox 360. I can't believe the Xbox 360 is already two generations ago. So that means, so there's no classic crafting, classic, classic crafting in this uh, version of Minecraft. So all we have to do is uh, just go ahead and make a big bunch. Oh, I miss that. I miss that. Brings me back. We'll make a couple sticks. I accidentally made two, two, that's, that's normal. That's normal. That was normal back then. You accidentally made two instead of one. But, um, we used up our wooden pickaxe already. So let's see if we can find a, a bear, a village from like this time, because I think that'd be an interesting, an interesting find. The sound of the sand too brings me back. Oh, look at that. That's so it's just so bare. I love it. It's great. All right, let's place the crafting table down, and we need to make some stuff. Uh, let's get some stone tools. First of all, let's try to see if we can make us a nice furnace, too. We're probably going to need one of those. And if anything, I have... So this is like a stupid little story that I have. Um, back when I was in middle school, which has been a pretty long time since I was in middle school, uh... One 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 thing is that me and my friend would play a ghost network server. It was actually the first time I would ever play Java Edition. Um, but we would go into a server and we would play it. It was called Ghost Network. I don't know if it exists anymore. I, I tried to find it multiple times because you know I own Minecraft now on, on my own PC, and I've tried to find it so many different times. Yeah, we would play it in computer class after we got our, our work done. And I, it's, what's funny is I don't really think our teacher liked the idea that we would play it because every time he, I, we would play or get, even get on it, he'd be like, get off a of craft or the mine. And it's just, I don't know, it's just this thing that's going to be a core memory that sticks into my head forever. Look at this ravine. So here's, what, here, here, here's the thing. Here's the deal. We're going to go ahead and exit without saving. And I'm going to find a world that has a village. And... I'll be right back as I do that. All right, so we were, we are basically where we're at, uh, like from the, from the other world. We got our full stone tools. Let's go ahead and explore this world and see what's in it. I hope this actually did work. Uh, we are gonna, okay, I'm gonna mine some of this coal, so. I miss the old textures too. The old textures were so iconic and stuff. It's just, it's, I don't know. It was amazing at the time. It was back in the day. Back in the day when everything was just simpler. You know what I mean? Whoa. That's one reason why you don't mine straight down. That is interesting, actually. That's, that kind of reminds me of today's Minecraft, actually. Oh, shoot. That doesn't remind me of today's Minecraft, but that also is kind of annoying. Let's go ahead and see if we can find some actual stuff down here. I mean, we definitely can find certain death. Like, oh my god, this zombie is freaking... Oh, I I see what I'm doing here. This full respawned, like, all right. Um, the newer mechanics of skeletons are actually way, way intense, way, way, way more intense. Actually, that's insane. That was easy. <laughs> We're gonna go ahead and give me a bit of an easy way to not die. There you go. It's probably already dark outside, by the way. I just want to explore the world, but I fell down in the cave. Actually, I went down there myself. There we go. We got light. 
we're not gonna go that way. We're, go we're, we're going this way. Um, hopefully I can find, um, a village. Hopefully there's a play. Yeah. Yay! It's, it did, I think it did work. All right. There's clearly no swimming animations, so we're just gonna have to deal with that. By the way, I'll take that sheep, by the way. And also, I'll take- I'll go ahead and pillage that village. Because the villagers, they didn't have no... Oh boy. It wasn't really hard to find. All we had to do is retrace our steps. And clearly, it wasn't that hard to do. <laughs> oh, by the way, we can actually just mix and match uh, wool in this version of Minecraft. And we can uh, definitely get... Um... So where's that? where was that village at? Because, like, I'm definitely going the wrong way. <laughs> I can't believe that I did not realize that I was half a heart. And I forgot that I was half a heart. That's unfortunate. Well, <sighs> you lose some and you learn some, I guess. Or whatever the hell the saying is. All right. Oh, this is at the time when gra uh, the thing was gr just gravel. Uh, I'll take the wheat because that's pretty much all that there was back then was just wheat and bread. Oh, villagers didn't make sounds back then. But yeah, the villagers, didn't, they didn't trade, they didn't do anything. That's because there's no emeralds. <gasps> You're pretty much useless. You do nothing. You make no sound. You don't do anything. You're, you're just a useless code. Yeah? I know. You know I know it's sad to say, but you just are, buddy. I didn't mean to hurt your feelings like that, but... <laughs> Very... It's like a horror game. <laughs> Jesus. All right. We, we got that. We got three more. We're going to make an iron sword just because. All right. We, we need the iron sword. All right. So we got we got the we got the iron. Look at that. We already got some iron tools. Um, so what I do want to do is I want I do want to go into the nether into this game uh, in this version. But I need to figure out like we need to set. So we're going to settle down in probably a villager house at the time. All right. Uh, in this playthrough. And then I'm gonna probably try to get to the nether as quickly as possible. So what I'll do is I'll even do like some strip mining as we used to do back in the day. No, I come to think of it, this guy's going crazy, but I am actually gonna take this house. And I'm gonna just get rid of their weird staircase thing. So now it is morning. Finally. It took me a long time to get to the morning. I, I even think this was before Desert Temples. This is also when beds weren't um, notorious for spawn points. So we're going to have to keep in that in mind. Um, we're definitely going to have to ask this guy to leave. But instead, we're going to not ask him to leave. And I'm going to go ahead and just do a couple things here. I'm going to put my stuff in here. So this is going to be our nice little setup thing that we have here going on. Uh, we'll definitely go ahead and do some other stuff as well. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get some trees real quick. Because that's what we're going to need to do. And then I'll probably go ahead and just make a mine right inside the house. But let's go ahead and grab some of these trees that are over here. Because I'm going to make a mine. We're going to get some diamonds. And then we're going to uh, we're gonna get we're gonna get some iron. We're going to make a bucket. We're definitely going to go ahead and go, go to the nether. I want to see the nether. And I definitely am going to. Even if I have to cheat at the end. Um, we're going to go to the end. We're going to go to the end. And we're going to do it. But right now, we're just going to play a nice, simple Minecraft. Definitely going to need to keep some sticks on me, probably. Because you never know when you're going to need them. But then again, why would I keep sticks on me? I don't know. We'll see. Don't go down in there, Linguini. All right? I tell you, you might fall and choke on something. I don't know. You might choke on something there, Linguini. Like, I'm telling you. Stay away from the hole. <laughs> all right. We should be good to go. And all we have to go down is down to freaking level 12 and start strip mining. And then we should be able to find some diamonds. So, yeah, let's go ahead and start doing this right now, actually.
All right, so I guess the only way we can go down there since that we now we have food is, well, to go down there and fight the skeleton. But this begs the question that there is multiple skeletons. Oh boy. Oh no. All right, of course I died. And of course. Skeletons back then are a lot slower, I've noticed. So this should theoretically be easy, right? This guy's gonna die. Well, we're still gonna uh, keep going down because that was the goal so i made this a one block thing i should have made it like a double but we will definitely make the other things double oh we do have a shovel i believe where'd the shovel go The stronghold was right there? And then again, I guess it is easy to find. Um, you want to know what? This is... <sighs> the problem is, is that it's so freaking hard to find Endermen in this version of the game. Because they don't spawn in the nether like they do now, right? So, this is insane. Um, but there is some stuff. Dude, how much hits do you take? Jeez Louise. All right, I kind of want to just finish my mining down to 12. 12. We are at 27. We're just going to have to keep mining through the stronghold until we get to Y12. So, let's find some diamonds, and then we'll find a cave with some lava, and we'll grab some lava, and we'll go ahead and get some obsidian. And then we'll definitely go to the, the nether pretty soon. We're actually kind of ready for it. I'm definitely going to stock up on some iron, even because I'm going to try to get enough diamond for a diamond sword, and then maybe I have enough string? I don't know if I killed enough spiders. Back to important businesses. We're uh, gonna do ahead and go ahead and do this, and of course, gravel's got to get in the way because why not, right? So we're gonna go ahead and uh, just go ahead and see if we can find some diamond in a relatively quick manner. It's already been pretty long time for for me, but I will say we do have a little bit of extra time. I will. And there we go. Booyah! We found the diamond. <laughs> we found the diamond. It's enough diamond. <laughs> uh, shit. We got it. Right next to condensed coal. All right. We need to add some bread and serve some celebration. Because we found six diamonds. And I'm going to go ahead and I'll just speed up the mining clip just so you guys know. We need to make a bucket so we can put water in it, so we can put the bucket on top of some water. Or the... Oh. <laughs> yeah, right. Uh, the bucket on top of some lava, so I can... Um, oh, we also have some flint as well, which is going to be great for a flint and steel. We can make that without a crafting table, so let's go ahead and do that right now. Put it and keep it in my inventory. Alright, let's go back. Yes! We found the, lo the lava. We found it, guys. This should work. Yes. All right, finally. We, we got what we needed. All right. Now, we are going to go into the nether portal uh, under underground. I, I, I put it underground because it would be easier for me to just to do that instead of, you know, mining a big bunch of obsidian. So let's, get, let's go into it. All right. Well, let's uh, take a look if there's another fortress or not. Um, there definitely is a... Oh, well... Gas are a thing back then. Um, and yes, they can also kill your 
portal, so I don't think why does it have to be so loud? Holy shit! Thank you for the ear, 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 eardrum rupture. That was very nice of you. That was very nice of you to rupture my eardrum. We're not just gonna leave this this empty-handed. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into a creative world. I'm gonna go into creative mode, and I'm gonna find the Nether portal, and we're going to go ahead and go into the end to end off this episode of the Minecraft Legacy Let's Play. This isn't going to be a full Let's Play because I don't really have... I don't really think that people are going to be interested in a full Legacy Let's Play. So with that being said, let's go into Creative and find another uh, in the end portal and go into the Legacy Edition. The time it was very first added to console. Let's go to the end. Now, we don't have to worry about anything. Whoa, look at that creative menu. All right. So let's go ahead and just clear out the old inventory. Because if we do do another episode, I will probably will just start a new world. Let's get some Eyes of Ender, though. Found the portal. There we go. All right. Let's go. Look at that. It doesn't even make sounds. Oh, man. All right. Into the end we go. Oh, yeah. I remember when you spawned in all these like weird little box boxes here's like the first version of whoa okay it looks very weird on this version like it looks like space this is the this right here is the end in minecraft uh legacy edition and it looks really really interesting they did change the background is trippy it's like static it looks like there's it, it it's infinite but it also looks like it's solid like when i do this it, it really is kind of interesting to say the least um of course it is a lot different in older versions of craft or newer versions of craft mine so yeah this is the end and i i was gonna try to do it like like you know authentically and if you guys really want me to do a series on the legacy edition i will but um it really would have to do it would have to do it would have to do okay. Old version of the Ender Dragon. Like, I mean, it doesn't look really any different other than that. Um, I mean, for real, honestly, it does shoot the same things. But you can actually collect the Dragon's Breath instead. With that being said, everyone, this has been the, the Minecraft Legacy Edition Let's Play that I just decided to do. Because I, I, I just wanted to go back to the old Let's Play of Minecraft and to see how it was. Go back to the nostalgia of, like, being, you know, younger again and... Just playing the older version of Minecraft because all this new stuff is just overwhelming and it really goes to show on how much they really did add over the years and how Minecraft has actually, how it's become, how it's become recently, how much of a game it has actually become and how much they polished it, how much they added and it's just, you know, the big caves and close up they it really shows you like what how it changed the game. And then it really is interesting. So yeah, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave it a like and subscribe. I do things like this all the time. And I do have another legacy game that we're gonna do a little let's play on. Um, I'm sure you guys can probably guess it. But with that, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.